okay hi guys so in this lecture we'll be starting off with a new chapter which is salt analysis so let's get started okay so salts can be classified into two types it can be a salt which has cation as a basic radical and it can also have an anion which is acidic radical okay so distinction of cation and anion of given mixture having one or more than one salt is salt analysis distinction of cation and anion of given mixture having one or more than one salt cation and anion are also named as basic and acidic radical respectively because during salt formation cation comes from base and anion comes from acid so we can write this that cation and anion are also named as basic and acidic radical respectively because during salt formation cation comes from base and anion comes from acid comes from acid so if you look at the example of salt formation so we have NaOH as the base and HCl as the acid it forms NaCl salt so cation comes from base and anion comes from acid so anion is called acidic radical and cation is called basic radical so this is how a salt is formed okay NaCl plus H2 obviously is formed next example can be we can have KOH which is a base CH3COH again a acid cation comes from base and anion comes from acid so we have CH3COOK here formed okay plus H2 next example we have BaOH whole twice and H2SO4 forming BaSO4 which is white PPT plus 2H2 okay next let us see the analysis of anion okay so we have AX2 plus BY2 plus CZ2 which are all insoluble salt reacting with Na2CO3 and then we boil it at temperature less than 100 degrees Celsius so we get 2NAx plus 2NAY plus 2NAZ Okay, so 
these are all water soluble salt and we also got ACO3 plus BCO3 plus CCO3 okay so these are all water insoluble salts these are all water insoluble salts okay next let us see the advantages of soda ext extract advantages of soda extract okay so by preparing it water insoluble salts are converted into water soluble salts and the cations are separated from anions So by preparing by preparing it water insoluble salts are converted into water soluble salts. and cations are separated from anions okay soda extract is nothing but Na2CO3 we just used here this is soda extract oops So with this we come to the end of this lecture, in the next lecture we will be continuing on seeing more on the same, so till then good luck and good bye.